let me say you want to solve a question under integration that is definite integration with a power lower limit especially those that have a trigger function sign the trigger functions what you need to do first which is actually important is to click on the shift mode 4 that is the first thing shift mode 4 shift mode 4 then that will move the calculator to radian that will move the calculator to radian you see uh, your calculator will not be showing rad not uh, degree or any other stuff you can see this this stuff now this is GRA this degree this rad so if you press shift mode 4 you will only be showing arrow not D anymore on the screen all right welcome back to our channel this this is the best academy oh uh, we are super excited to see you guys back on the welcome back to learn so i just want to show you guys how to solve definite integral with your uh, scientific calculator which may be useful uh when computing the some mathematics uh mathematical questions or problems so uh what you have to do now remember the first procedure is to press shift mode 4 press shift mode 4 and you press the city graph sign and you go to the upper side click on what you have there let's say we have pi over 2 in the upper side so you click on pi over 2 to, to click on pi you press shift you press exponential that will give you pi shift exponential then over 2 over 2 then you press 2 let's say lower limit is 0 then you press 0 there let's say in this place we are having sine the uh, s by sine cube x or sine 4x by sine raised power 4x so look how we are going to do uh, you press sine then you press x then you press raised to power 4 it is also very important to even something like uh, close everything close everything put the sign at the x and also press raised to power 4 we still give this in so that will give you 3 power over 16 3 power over 16 then even though it's cost 4 s is still the same thing even this is cost you still give the same answer if, uh, if it is uh, let's say 6 you still have uh, 5 pi over 32 so 5x so uh, what you have to do is just know how to set up your calculator to read and by the first um, major thing there we'll do is 3 we'll still give you something 2 over 3 we'll do is uh, let's say uh, let's say we're having the uh, 5 you still have a question which is uh, 8 over 15 let's see with that here we do we have two things so let's say we have sine cube we have cos cube x and we also have sine with it all you have to do is also to multiply with sine the other sign you just sign the let's say sine 2x like sine square x sine square x you just press sine and press square then you have your answer which is a uh, 2 over 15 that's where i go to have 2 over 15 it will do is sign cos s equals 5x cos 5x and the uh, sign the square s is 1 8 over 1 over 8. Also, calculator may give the answer in the degree which is 0 0.076. So, what you have to do is just to check the fraction that is equivalent to this uh, degree. That's what you do. It will do is sign, it will do is 3 here, uh, 1 over 24. It will do is, it will do is 4. It is for see our answer it was uh, 3 15. so that's how the stuff is so remember the first you do is press shift mode 4 by the first thing all right well you can go ahead and try to calculate and see if you can do it yeah thank you